And welcome back to Flexible Games, where we are playing Fortress Craft Evolved. All right, I've got the, uh, a little bit of power distribution in here. I mean, it's not anything fancy or special, but, you know, it'll do well in a pinch. Uh, okay, so last episode we got the system up and running here. Um, or at least it's up. It's not running yet. And yeah, we've got some power distribution in here. Not a whole lot, but it'll have to do for now. Okay, so one thing we're going to want is uh, we're going to get, uh, let's see, where are they at? Where's, a good, where's a good tab to use? Um, well, right in here, I think, is our best bet. We want ablators, liquefiers. So remember, it's two ablators for every liquefier. So if we do ablator, 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 and we do a liquefier in between, we could put a hopper right here and it will work just fine. And uh, that also leaves some, some room to, to expand here. Um, now, elsewhere, I mean, we're gonna want one on this setup you know, all all four sides of this, we're gonna need a setup like that. So, you know, it's just a it just takes a lot of tubes and a lot of things to get everything going. So, liquefier, liquefier, hopper. Uh, do I want to go up or down with this? I want to go down I went over on that one but that might not be the best liquefier liquefier hopper and we could put another setup up top if we want okay same thing here later 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 Liquefier, liquefier, and hopper. And I'm using Tricky's hoppers here because we want to be able to move stuff out pretty fast. And then let's do liquefier, liquefier, hopper. Okay, that takes care of all of those. Now, these things want a lot of power, a lot of power. And three lasers are just not an, not going to be enough, but we'll still we'll start ramping things up as we start getting resin because we're gonna, we're gonna we're gonna need a lot of resin, so you know power can be ramped up, all sorts of things. And I know some people probably spotted the fact that I've got chrome and moly in my inventory. And yes, I did go do some exploring, and I I actually um, super dug some of that and it automatically scanned it for me i didn't i didn't go back and scan the the uh i didn't go back and scan the uh, veins to see how big they were so i still don't know if those are going to be like let's see if those are oh i just i just can't win with the jetpack Okay, that's going the right way. Let's go down and pick that up. Thank you. And you need to build all the way out. You need to build all the way out. Uh, and this one, of course, liquefier. Yes, we're gonna go on the other side of this side this time. Thank you very much. And tubes. That way, that way, we're going to take one more off, go that way. Okay, so, no, 
this way. There we go. Let's uh, try to line these up. Okay, that takes care of all of those. Now, tough part. I need to bring these down. And we're going to go, is that right? I never can tell. Okay. Looks like that arrow is going the right way. So we're going to go one in. And then one out. That takes care of those. And we can also put some ablators and stuff down here. And just in case some stuff comes up, um, never know. So both of these lines now come in right over here, which is perfect as we're going to have this go down. We're going to have this go down. And we're going to punch it through. So it's going to go all of the resin that we're going to get from here is going to come out of the system or out of the box, and it's going to come down here and get processed instead of stay up there. Uh, as far as power over here, that is a little trickier of a question. Because um, we have so many lasers and stuff here, I might need... I might need a little... Hmm... Let's put a, uh, yeah, let's put a Mark III battery right there. Underneath that, we're going to have another laser. Uh-oh, is that poked through? I think that's poked through. We're going to poke this through this side. And then this is going to be our, our power for our resin system. I could even go underneath that one. Ah, let's do that. So, way over here, just in case. Might as well put another layer on that on either side. We've got the we've got the construction paste. I'm not worried about that. We have ample amounts of construction paste. Okay. Oh, I went up one too many levels. Okay, now why is that only going that far? Whatever so we're going to go that way. Can you reset your your system? There you go. Um, over here, we're going to have a battery. And then we're going to have a resin refiner right behind here. Dun, dun, dun. I know I've got one of those. Liquid resin refiner. And then or it's cover this up with glass there we go so this thing is going to want 64 power per second which is this uh, this can do in spades so we don't need to bump that up at all um, but we are pulling from a battery that you know it's going to be touch and go we might need a whole different turbine just to power this and this because we don't want those, we don't want those uh, getting all mixed up. Uh, okay, so right here, I'm thinking 2,000 slot hopper, remove only. This one's going in there. We want to push this one in there. So both of those are independent and pushing into there independently. And then we're going to have this coming out. So that's remove only. That stores a lot of resin, or liquefied resin, I should say. And this guy 
liquefied resin, total of four items needed. Um, I'm not sure what my ratios are on that now that I've split that off. Um, I still think it only crafts one at a time, but it needs fewer of the liquefied resins to do it. So we're going to craft that. We're going to put that down, and then we're going to have a massive amount of storage. So we are going to use some 2,000 slot hoppers. So there, uh, there, 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 and there. So lots and lots of storage. Because I want to be able to come up here and just grab a lot of resin when I need it. Uh, okay, so we're going to bring... Up, 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 and then again, we are going to feed this thing power from itself, just like so. Okay, so the refinery is ready, the turbines are ready, the 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 bladers and the liquefiers, those are all ready. Except we don't have any power over here. Like this whole system is you know, dependent on power. Um, the other thing we're going to want is a way to feed it. Ooh, you know what I didn't do? Uh, I didn't uh, set this up. So anybody who is yelling at me going, uh, dude, you might want to connect the ones in the middle. So let's do that. And we're, we're out of the way. We didn't, we didn't cover anything up. We're out of the way. We still can work with conduits once we get to those um so yeah we are set up and ready to go we just need power over here and a way to feed this thing so feeding it we are going to use instead of trying to figure out a minox system to go to we are going to try to figure out uh, a way to feed this thing that's more or less good to go so, one way to do that is by using matter movers, because they need line of sight, and we're going to want another liquefier. Let's see, where do we want this liquefier? Yeah, we're going to put this, we're going to put this guy I'd like to put him here, but he's going to use this. Because I need a liquefier that isn't connected to this. Because uh, we're going to feed the hive itself. So one thing I want to do, let's... Put that, whoa. The floaty jetpackness. So obviously this needs to go out like that, um, which gives us the ability to put one of these guys here. So we're going to have another liquefier. Let's throw in another ablator just for good measure. Uh, and then we want like a nano hop. We want a, we want a small hopper. We don't want a ginormous hopper over here. Uh, so yeah, a small hopper will be fine. Uh, let's see. Um, if we cover that up, that would be bad. So, I'm trying to think of a way that we can do this without blocking. So, if we put that up there. Hmm. Ideally, you would have the matter mover pointing up through the thing so I think we're gonna need a laser with a couple like a piece of glass a battery 
like so. Now, how do we want to do this? This is very confusing. Uh, let's do a liquefier on the top. Or do we want that on the side? We might want that on the side. Because the hopper, regardless of which way the hopper goes, it's going to be, it's going to not work. So, we want the liquefier here. Then the small hopper. Oh, the floatiness. So, there we go. And then the matter mover. Woo! This was a brain teaser. Matter mover straight up there. Okay, now we need, because the matter mover is going right up through the hive, uh, we're going to now want a manufacturing plant, which I know I crafted four of those. We want a void hopper. Let's craft one of those. And uh, where is the coordinates of this? Uh, okay, so this is uh, minus 25, 173. Minus 25, 173. Okay, let's go. So, minus 25, 173. Right there. This is the location. And uh, let's, oh. That's where that beam will, will hit when it has a you know a free or, or or clear line of sight that square right there is lined up with that matter mover so what we want to do is we want to put the void hopper up there and set it hive mind feeding okay so when this thing gets an item it will feed the the hive so let's try to feed it like one, one little item. Make sure it worked. Hmm. Did, did it grow anywhere? I'm not sure, actually. If it grew anywhere or not. Maybe. Let's check. It's still listed as the... Yeah, it's still listed as the uh, active hive. Well, let's power the system up, at the very least. I do have a few starter composite fuels to actually get this process started. So, let's put them right here. And they're going to go across, and they're going to start feeding whoa, all of these things. And it looks like this is indeed able to use these ones here, which is nice. A, that's a nice change. Okay, so our power should be starting to flow. Yep, it's starting to work. And these things have started their searching. They do a, a spherical search area. And yeah, it can be. All right, there we go. First, our first one. It's hard to catch these. 
when they're in, in process. Hmm. Cannot rescan block. Oh yeah, our first liquefied resin actually went down. Yeah, the, the liquefiers are just too fast. You cannot scan. I need one. Oh, it's so hard to hit those. The 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 research thing is just it just is too long. It it just takes way too long for it to actually do anything. Um you need one where it's not getting very much power. That's the only way to do it. Hey, I think I got one. Whoa, let's not let's not stand right there. Let's uh Okay. So, we've started, as you can see, getting the resin. Right now, it's all going into this to process more fuel. And as such, I need to drop off a few more fuel canisters. Uh, can I... Fine, I'll do this. There's a hundred more. Should be... Should be fine. A hundred more should be more than enough once it's empty to keep that going. And look at that, we've actually got a, like a surplus. Yeah, we've got a surplus. Now are we going net gain on power? It looks like we do. Definitely a net gain up here. Uh, and how are we doing on, oh yeah, we got resin coming in from all, yeah, we got resin coming in from all over the place right now. Good times. Uh, why isn't this okay? This that's not that's not working too well. Let's. I don't have any lenses. Let's go find some lenses. I have a feeling we're gonna we're gonna have a few because I need I need that liquefier and stuff. The the process won't work unless that is actually doing something. Uh, where where are my pristines at? I completely forgot where I did that setup over here. Okay, so let's get ten massive eyes and power distribution. Exceptional organic lens. Okay, so I want to make sure. Wow, toasty. Let's go way out here. Uh, let's put in one, two, three. Oh, toasty. And then we want one, two, three. Much more power. And this should now, at least in theory, get a little bit of power. I'm going to pump some power into this thing. He's full. There we go. I want I just wanted a little bit of resin in here for when the time came. Uh looks like oh it looks like it's getting power again cuz we're actually feeding it more power than we're moving out. We're moving we're moving 9 in, but 3 of them have have lenses and we have we have 9 coming out, but none of them have lenses. So it should be a net gain of power.
and uh, we are tearing this thing apart and where is this line right here I'm hoping that this is close enough I always build these too big you know it's I always like way over complicate the, the system here um, like I don't know we might need a system right up here to grab them well maybe not looks like looks like they're going away okay unknown block detected interesting I'm not sure what that was all about they're just taking a while yeah I got it I got a scan done awesome now this thing should pop through right about now it should be able to send there it is and there it starts growing again and as soon as it grows over that it'll it'll cut that off and it won't grow anymore so it'll grow a little bit and then get cut back and then grow a little bit and get cut back so yeah it looks like we are we are golden right here now we just got to keep an eye on you know after this runs for a while you know, come back and check it and see if you have pockets of resin that are not getting processed and that will be the telltale the telltale sign uh, of something is amiss but yeah we are growing the hive and finally getting should be getting a surplus of resin uh, refined resin so if we look at this we might need another refiner because what is this craft now it's about three seconds and we're still filling up Whoa. still filling this up this is finally yeah we are yeah I think we're good uh, let me take this we've got plenty of fuel canisters we're getting some fuel once this is full everything uh, will slow down we'll start getting a surplus of resin so while this runs we can go on and, and do bigger and better things um, but yeah, this resin is vital for the next, you know, many things that we're going to want to do. Um, you know, and we may need, we may need another, another refiner. I mean, we just, we just have so much resin right now. I might need to build another refiner and figure out a system for that. Hmm. Well, I'll look at it in between episodes and see what we see what we're gonna have to do about that. I might I might need a induction induction thing for that. But uh, yeah, let me let me do some some thinking on that, and we'll come back next episode. So I thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.